Alrighty, folks. It is uh, 8 a.m. here in probably my one of my favorite smallmouth destinations, Millie Lax. Millie Lax, Lax of Mill, Molax. I'm going fishing with my. He's my now good buddy, Murray. He's a great dude. He took me walleye fishing in the winter here. I said, hey, dude, I've got one day. I would sit in, in Minneapolis for a day or I can come smallmouth fishing. He picked me up yesterday and we are here about ready to smash some wall or walleyes. Wow. About to smash some smallmouth with his buddy who has a boat. So it's going to be fun. Murray, is it going to be fun, Murray? It's going to be super fun, AP. Be like super fun. fun. I don't really have to be wearing these bibs because it's about 80 degrees out right now, but since I finally got my bags back from Delta, I'm gonna I'm gonna wear them just just cause. Just cause. Holy cow dude, I've gotta take these bibs off. Yeah. It's just not even funny how hot it is. We've made it out on the water. First spot, didn't idle too far. Slick, calm conditions, call for a little drop shot. What do you think, Murray? What are you throwing? Tube. Tube? Three-inch tube. Fish. Fish. Smallmouth. Small this is Nick. Nick is lucky enough, or I'm lucky enough to have Nick take me out here today. A little smallmouth. That was like the first five minutes. That's a good sign. Little male. Some big ones. Some big ones. Talking to himself. So are you talking to the fish, bud? Yeah. Yeah, to ask him. Oh. Yeah, that is, that's a lot. No. Big. No. Big. It's alright. That's, that's a good one. That's a three pounder. Four pounder. Well, Murray might have figured something out. He took one cast of the jerk bait. That is a nice smallmouth. Look at you, buddy. Nothing wrong with that. Nothing at all. He's got some eggs in it, Nick. That was one jump right there, too. Oh, baby, that that one's mine. You're a cage, boys. Yeah, I might be on that. Too. Got him? Oh. Got him. It's not a bad one either. It's a good one. That's my bad fish. First Malak smallmouth hooked up. It's a freaking toad. Not a not a giant, but still a three and a half pounder. I think the key to we're gonna have to kinda stay off the beds. Yeah, try not to blow over. Yeah. Or we could just blow over them and not catch them. That's what Murray wants to do. What? I was just playing with them. I can get them. You want me to get them, Murray? If you want to, Barry. I feel like we're still sleeping right now. Yeah, you are. Oh, yes. <laughs> that is what you like to see. That little drop shot just in the corner of their mouth. Those eyes. Look at, that's, that's three and a half pounds all day. Would you agree with that statement? Yeah. That's three and a half pounds all day. All right, I like that. First one of the day for myself. That's a nice one. Decent. Dude, they look so much smaller when they're down there. Hey, I told you to wait so I get the camera out, man. What happened there? You just got too excited. He bet. He bet. He bet. So we've come. When they're gonna bite. We ran around the lake a little bit. You know, we haven't really found much. So now we're gonna try and target some beds. Uh, this time of year, these fish get up obviously on beds. It's early spring. That's what he just caught that one on. But um, there's been a lot of pressure on here on Malax. So wow, this camera's all over the place. There's been a lot of pressure out here on Malax. So we've kind of got to slow down pick these fish off these beds we're all going to take turns and uh 
Nick just caught that one, so uh, it's Murray and I next. Are we gonna catch a fish, dude? So you know the drop shot wasn't really working that good, so I'm gonna try this little tiny Ned rig. Just gonna rig that thing up. Beautiful. Oh, there was one here too, yeah. Up. Hooked up. Look at. <laughs> no, no. Oh, it's dead. Dude, hey, bud. No way. VMC. Holy cow, VMC. Wow. I told you, dude. I've had it had before. VMC? That yeah, brand new, right? Never used. No, Out of the box, VMC. Just made me lose him, dude. He, I hooked him. Wow. I think I'm gonna actually just go to a bait caster with 17 pound flipping line. Oh. oh. I'm using Nick's six stick right now because somehow I managed to break off my tungsten weight, managed to break off that mushroom jig, broke off my Ned rig. It's just been a breaking off kind of day for me. I've kind of been struggling out here, not gonna lie. They've caught some fish that I haven't really shown because uh, I've always been retying. So I need to kind of get some redemption here. I got, I got a feeling this is my redemption fish. Oh, she had it. God dang it. She freaking had it. No, she had it in her mouth and then she tried to chase it out. Only problem with the Senko is it takes like eight years to get down there. Can't tell where my Cinco goes. All right, come on, eat it. Got her. Oh yeah! Finally, finally, freaking caught, got this fish to bite. This is probably my biggest smallmouth this year. Little tiny Ned rig. Oh my gosh, this is a toad. I'm so glad I'm not fighting this on my spinning rod. Oh, come here. Come here, big girl. Come here. Yes. Look at that smallmouth right there. You don't understand how good this feels. I have been breaking off. I've been breaking hooks. I've been just losing so many smallmouth. Switched up to this beefy jig head. Look at that jig head. That fish wasn't coming off. That fish wasn't coming off. Oh. I'm so happy, I'm like speechless. Here goes this Mille Lacs giant. Little Ned Rig does the trick. Fish was mean. Dude, I caught a smallmouth. That's awesome. How crazy is that? Oh, oh no. Oh, right there. Look at him. Just pulled though. We're really around him now, boys. Oh my god, dude! They're charged up. They're charged up. Oh man! Oh. Ah. Little guy. Little guy. This guy is the bed fishing master today. Freaking destroying us. Murray, that fish gave you some chances. <laughs> I'm speechless. You're speechless? It was fun. Again? It was fun. Give me my hat. That's I my probably hat. should put that on my head. Nick, thank you so much, dude. Yeah, for sure, man. Freaking blast. Time. How many did you catch compared to mine? What did I catch, like five? You caught like 30? Yeah, probably. He killed them on the craw today, guys. Just absolutely murdered them. 
Murray killed him. He caught some on the drop shot and on the craw. And I kind of just watched, you know, had a couple fish, which uh, hopefully made this video enjoyable for you guys. But tomorrow I actually meet up with the Dugan squad again. Uh, we're going tarpon fishing in Florida, which is going to be unreal. So hopefully you guys enjoyed today's episode. We'll catch you guys probably tomorrow, maybe the next day. We'll catch you guys on another. Up. Yeah. Wait, wait. I guess we'll see you guys tomorrow. Yeah. We redo that. We gotta redo that. You gotta actually punch, like, give it a good punch. Okay. Like, just do it now.